on our winter storm alerts throughout the area. A new winter storm warning has been issued. All the areas in purple on average five to eight inches of new snow accumulation likely about 12 in the mountains. Northeastern Montana winter weather advisory two to four inches in this area and looking at north central all the way down into southwestern Montana also Winter weather advisories in effect about two to five along the high line and about three to six in southwestern Montana with the mountains likely picking up another 10 inches or so over the next few hours. So four below is what we're waking up to in Great Falls 11 below in Cutbank right now. That's actual air temperature, not even the feels like temperature. Still a couple lingering 20s in northeastern Montana. Today we'll see daytime highs in the teens, almost in the single digits along Cutbank. Uh, 18 in Haver today, 15 in Great Falls, 14 in the capital. Uh, high 20s though in northeastern Montana. Big story today, we're going to see another round of snow move through. We've got that core of the weather system that we've been tracking moving just to the south and making its way east. That's going to rewrap around, uh, <coughs> wrap some moisture across central Montana again. We'll see the first wave likely around the noon hour. Then it's going to become more widespread and heavy late this afternoon into the evening. That snow will take us through the remainder of your Friday into the first part of Saturday as well. Overnight low temperatures, single digits for central Montana, six degrees in the capital, seven in Great Falls and a couple of 20s in northeastern Montana as well. Future track for your Saturday. We'll still see some lingering flurries early tomorrow. The core of that system will continue to move off though to the east. So if you have travel plans tomorrow, the worst snow tomorrow afternoon is going to be pretty much in eastern Montana. We'll gradually start to see those skies clear out as the day progresses on Saturday as well. Saturday's temperatures a little bit warmer. Teens along the High Line, 21 in Great Falls. Same story in the capital with mid 20s in eastern Montana and more snow. Snow totals on average for central Montana looking at an additional five to eight. Helena could see about three to five or so. More though into southeastern Montana and south central Montana. If you have travel plans to head to that portion of the state here the next day or so, that's going to be the area you want to keep an eye to the sky. So to kind of show you where that system is and what we've got headed our way by Sunday, some high pressure is going to rebuild over the state. That's going to allow for clearing conditions. That's going to stick with us here at least through the first part of this next week, keeping temperatures a little bit more mild and uh, more seasonably average for the next few days. So over the next seven, here's what we're looking at. 15 today, 20s to follow with some lingering flurries Saturday morning, 30s then up to 42. So likely going to get a little bit slushy for us on Tuesday as all that snow starts to melt here in the capital looking at 14 degrees more snow today lingering flurry Saturday. We do have the potential of some wind kicking up first part of this next week. We'll keep an eye on that as well. Keely.